Hello and welcome back to Pacific Drive. So in the last one, we uh, we got we, we went to town, town quote unquote, where where the town should have been, uh, Sarum, I think that's how they said it, Saram, uh, and we found this 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 giant anomaly, and we drove right into it, and it turns out uh, Oppie is now a little more understanding of us, I guess. So she's uh, willing to work with us and what she wanted which says right here there's a way to get where where you need to go and it involves turning on old zone stabilizers so we're going to be heading back to the town to do that pretty much right away because i've already i've already taken care of all the prep stuff between episodes uh crafted what i could we have no repair putty so i can't finish repairing the car but it it's gonna have to be fine because i don't have any chemicals for it. There are a lot of extreme condition zones here. Uh-oh. Well, we need to head here. And the only way to head there, I'm assuming we have to go through four or five. Part of me wants to go through five. Just to see what this is like. Swift storm? What does that do? Anchor Obfuscation, which I have a radar now for, so I could see it regardless. Alright, let's go find out. I think I'm going to take that route. I know it's dumb and risky, but... Uh, that's part of the fun. I also figured out uh, about quirks with the car last time, and, and actually fixed, like, three quirks. Three quirks very quickly. They're pretty obvious, but I have a feeling some of them are going to be a little obscure as far as, like... Like, the the one where I had to back up and then the hood opened, that was obvious. But I guess if they're obscure, what's the point in fixing them? If, if they're not, like, super affecting the car. So... Screw it. We're trying it. It says no, none for time. What does that mean? <laughs> does that mean I have to get in and out of here as quickly as I can? There is currently... Oh, this one doesn't seem to be moving at all. Oh, we're not in it yet. Which means... We can actually search over here. Oh my god, there's two, there's two energy though. Do I risk it? Holy, yeah, we were turning the lights on. And the wipers. They don't really seem to help that much, though. I, I mean, I haven't ran into a situation where the windshield is blocked when I don't have them on. Oh, I guess... Would everything be repopulated? Even though... Uh-oh. That looked like a abductor. Yeah, I guess, like, the cars are, are back to being built. Wait! You just moved! What? You, you just moved it... Oh... Never mind, I don't think we're going for the energy source. I don't think we can. <laughs> I have no charge left. Uh-oh. Alright. Let's, let's see how bad this gets. We're kind of like riding the line of the storm. And... Alright, now we're gonna be in it. A sudden dramatic change in atmospheric pressure has reduced 
powerful but extremely localized winds. Be careful. This could be extremely dangerous. For me? Or for things running at me? Like, dangerous is in... I'd love to see some things fly at me. Oh no, there's a thing right next to me, isn't there? Shit, I need to try to get it. Oh, get out. This thing isn't working. Oh no! Oh, oh, there we go. That might be too far away though. Oh my god, the wind is so loud. They're still over there. I don't have a map. I think I should just take the car and assume. Let's get inside. Loving the sound design here. It's a little loud, but that's the point. Oh. Ah. <laughs> okay. Well. Wait. Can I keep doing that? Hold on. No. I see. <laughs> Materials are going flying. Do you work more than... No, it's just like a once per visit kind of thing. Okay. Friendly dumpster. No! No! Ooh. It's a new state. Feeling drained? This battery is running dry faster than it should. Thanks to oxidization. Oxidization. And this could be due to damage, a faulty connection, or some strange anomaly. Regardless, it will need fixing. Um. Isn't it a rock? It's a, it's a dumpster pearl. Okay. Alright, just get in the car. No! Shit. What the? What what happened? I, like blacked out for a second. Oh, you are moving. Okay. Great, now it says it's right in the middle. Oh no, it is bad. Yep. Ooh. I know. I know. Wait, is everything closing in on me? What is that? They're treating it like an active gateway right now. Wait, hold on. Before I go out here, which... I think it's just... It's distorting it, but it might not actually be there.
Oh no, they actually are there. You know what? We're we're moving on. Oh no. I think it was worth it to test what these areas are like, and they are not impossible to navigate, but my god, anchor obfuscation is not going to be helpful. I just, I have no energy, so that kind of sucks. Alright, we're back. No storms here. There's a whole lot standing between where we are and the deep zone. Like another wall, and the entire mid zone for starters. It's not as simple as driving there. We can't control the instability any more than we can control what? the weather. What the? At the height of Lim R and D, thousands of us lived and worked here in the zone. So we built Lim stabilizers to make certain sectors and roads a little more predictable than others. It was the only way we could operate as a live research compound, despite the instability. And yes, the same technology that destabilized the landscape in the first place. Technology was always a double-edged sword from the beginning. We're going to put those stabilizers to work and clear you a path. The old observation towers surrounding Sierra Mora have a map of the stabilizers in that sector. Mind swinging by and finding one? Sure. Find the observation tower. Uh, oh, oh, now it's on the map. First things first, though. I'm getting that energy. Uh, I think I could just park it on the dirt road here on the right. Off, off. Yeah, you're already off. Okay, so it's... Right there. You got anything in here? No. Okay, so you can't you can't break this at all. Go. Oh, I need to analyze you. Minute man? Teletype, auto script, art, uh, something, hopper. Uh, well, I'm very sorry to hear that you find my anger and frustration difficult to deal with, even intimidating, but I wonder if you'd react the same if you were your male colleagues came to you with similar complaints or dissatisfaction. I've been on hold for two hours, and I'm calling to warn you of a new danger that is very much in everyone's interest to know about. Do you understand? No, listen to me. Write this down. We're seeing more and more anomalies capable of electrogenesis, of uh, producing electric energy like an eel or a ray, but at remarkable levels. This is enormously dangerous, and I don't care what secrets Arda wants to keep. This is about people's safety, their lives. This has nothing to do with me trying to muscle in on research or put myself on, back on some half-assed program. It's about you idiots understanding the risks you're hiding from people. Now, let me send this data through. Oh, you want to talk about theories? How about, how are you on limb wave interpol- in, in, Interpolation? In, I think that's like, interpolation. Or Patel's theory that Arda have twisted the peninsula into some kind of Klein bottle, where the inside is now the outside as well? Or do you want me to to want to put me through to somebody who's actually interested in making things happen. Yeah. That, uh, that guy's certainly I've been there. Oh my god. You think that was a bad, a bad thing I just did? <laughs> Those things suck. Nope. 
Bam. Well, that was a decent amount of energy. Um, turn on the car. Okay, you're on. Alright, let's head to that observation. Okay. Oh, they switched. Of course they did. Why wouldn't they? Whoa, 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 whoa. What's going on with my door? Huh? I'm going to need you to stop being, uh... So electrically charged at the moment. I don't think it's going to stop. I guess I'll close it and I'll just make sure I open it before I get out? What is happening to my door? Oh my god. You're a little quiet. The towers are locked up tight, but you can tighten up security protocols all day only for one disgruntled employee to program in his name for fun and mess it all up. Anyway. The overload code is 4735. Find that stabilizer map and scan it for me. Okay. Oh, oh boy. I was assigned to clean these towers out every time the gods rotated. The things I saw. Let's just say that keeping a watch on Sierra day in and day out did not make for a good time. I didn't envy those gods one bit. No, oh, it stopped. There we go. She did just give us a call. Oh man, I miss I miss my vacuum. Uh, unfortunately, it broke, and I haven't made the blueprint for it. I'm very I'm I'm going to make the blueprint as soon as I can. Hold up. We were up on one of the old fire roads doing maintenance on a new gate, and dusk was fast approaching. At first, I thought it was Carlos on his radio. I, I, I thought Carlos had his radio on, but then I realized the sound was much too clear. There were dozens of them, moving like a swarm. They were a deep orange like embers of a fire. Each one of them made a sound of some sort, like wind chimes, but softer. Oh. We sat and watched them from a f for, for an hour. Before they suddenly faded out. Never seen anything like it. Crimson, deep orange. Hey, where'd I get crimson from? I actually don't know. I just thought of the word crimson. Deep orange sounds kind of like a chime. Doesn't sound like a deadly thing. Gear to duct tape? I don't think that's even worth it. Damn. All right. This map uh, found in the observation tower near Seiram gives a detailed layout of the stabilizers in the immediate area. The stabilizers? As if the zone could ever be contained. I got it. I'm overlaying the map with the available routes near you. Thank you. Three sector stabilizers that'll do the job. They're not too far, so I've added the location to your route. The access road will lead you straight there once you're ready. So the stabilizer we have to we have to head out here to get that. I guess we'll get this on the way, but uh I don't know what I maybe just go along the top then to, to head back there, because Hup. 
Hey. Uh, passed by a few good places to pick up mats and stuff on the way, but we're officially on our way forward. Oh, there is a house right there. There's a house right there. I feel like we've been here before. But we have, because this is kind of the same exact place as last time. Where, where the... Cappy? Co copy? Cappy or copy? What, I, I forgot what, what she called it. Where that anomaly is. Uh, but we searched the outside over here, and the, these houses in that car right there seem lined up in the same spot? Potentially? I don't know. What I really need you to give me, though, are a ton of chemicals. So I can actually make repair, buddy, because... It sucks not having it. Wait! Oh, let me back up for a sec. I don't have... You on my bar? Could be six. And then back. Uh, I do need to eat. And again. And again. Okay, we're about to take some damage, so... <sighs> Nothing... Hell yeah. God damn it. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, yeah. We are absolutely still in danger here. I'm going to just exit. There's nothing more creepy than those mannequins, or test dummy, whatever you want to call them, being, being inside there. <laughs> and then you just turn around and see them. Okay, I'm just going to stay along the top. I, I do, I'm not searching this whole place. This is huge. Oh, wait, no, that's a big one. Oh. Alright, I have a feeling I'm gonna be here for a minute. Oh. Wait, there's like a barbed wire fence here? Alright, eat another one. This whole place is irradiated? How do we get in? There we go. Oh my god. There's probably a ton of materials here, though, so I probably should. Just gotta be fast. Um, bam. Queue up. I guess I will leave you there for a minute. Ooh! Anomaly Encounters 4. Alright. No, this isn't like that hat guy. This is something else. I've never seen the face. I never see the face, but it's always the a figure. A shadow. Kind of fuzzy and gray. A bunch of us have all had the same kind of dreams now, but we'll be... Dreams now. We'll be in the forest somewhere. The figure is always b beside us. Hard to see. It points towards something, and when we wake up... There's always something where it had pointed. In the real life version of that place, one time it was this nest of stuff like frog spawn. Another, it was the first crawler in the zone. What's a crawl? Crawler? And once it was, it, it was what was left of Jack. I think I enunciated certain words incorrectly there. Huh. 
it's a shape-shifting anomaly? Maybe, by the sounds of it. Okay, we got you. Oh. Damn, we got a lot of stuff out of that. You're already checked. Alright, I am not doing too good health-wise. God damn it, and there's four places to... And you? Um, yep. And then... Oh, shit. I need chemicals. I actually probably picked a few up and I didn't even know this, but... There's not really time to just verify everything I pick up until later. 64. Oh no, we need to eat again. This one's dark. Uh, you. Ooh, ooh. Need you. Is that it? I think I missed this side. Blue paint? Oh, hell yeah. Oh. <laughs> I'm hitting all the buttons. There we go. We got quite a, quite a good haul here. This is a, this is a good little spot. You locked? No. Uh oh, another memo? Didn't we just read this? No, we didn't. Briefly, a widespread blight. This tiny flying anomaly would bore into oil or gas tanks to seemingly drink from them? Oh. Rust colored about the size of a horsefly and mo fast moving. These were common through the summer of 1962. Though tougher than an insect, most could be swatted or stomped on. The sightings are now extremely rare, but occasionally still logged. Okay. I have a feeling if I want to identify all the anomalies or scan them, I'm gonna have to notice when my gas is leaking and then try to run out and get it if it's super rare. And really tiny. Oh my. Hi. Whew. That was a bit. I'm fine. My hair is kind of standing up on end, though. Oh, good. We're finally not in danger. I'm going to actually use a med, med kit. Bam. Full health. Okay. I can put you two in here. Lots of materials. I guess I'll put you in there, too. And we're good. What? W what's going on with my... Oh, they're just showing that they're pretty low. I see. That's not my car sparking, is it? Kind of seems like it's my car sparking. My aching soul is terrible. My aching soul is terrible. I can't tell. It's my car. It's fo the, the sound's following me. It's definitely. 
another spot? Well, at least we have the car in here this time. I'm gonna leave it on, actually. We have plenty of gas. Don't you dare come this way. I needed that. That will speed things up. Ooh, more black paint. Awesome. Vogue, alluring, mysterious. Black is eternally popular, always chic, and forever debonair. Cruise the zone in the, in the most fashionable of colors. Make everyone ask, who is she? Gentle yet strong, humble yet beautiful, lingering towards the moodiest end of the spectrum. The color blue is the true artist's choice. Moodiest? Blue is supposed to mean, like, calm. The opposite of moody. Alright, these rest of these houses are going to take a while, so... Oh, God. What? Dude, those abductors make some noises. Uh, I think it got pissed because it saw my flare and it just started making these. Oh, you ass. Woo, okay. I parked my car in a very bad spot, apparently. Oh, chemicals. You distracted? I need to grab this fast. I'm basically done here, but... Nothing, and we're good. Now you, stay there. He almost drove right through the goddamn... Right, keep that light off. He almost drove me right through a uh, mannequin, and it would have exploded on the car. That's a that's a tree. Okay, I'm I'm turning these back on. I can't see. We have a lot of materials though. That that gave me so. So many materials. I just have to not die. <laughs> A lot of, uh... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, you could break these. Of, co of course you can. Why didn't I think of that? Alright, uh, so I'm gonna go left into this station, and then we're gonna grab the thing and get the hell out of here. I could probably refuel, though. Which means... Right about there. Ah. So many things to maintain. Okay. Um, you... Refuel. Do we have another one of those things in here? Decor? No. Damn. Oh, it looks like I don't have a pry bar, bar anymore. I think I broke it while I was panicking over that thing. Oh, hey! Can I take you with? 
A random bear statue. Okay, I think that I think that's it. Um nothing to put in there. We have so many chemicals. Oh, I can't call them right. I'll put it away later. We don't we don't need to do it right now. Um There we go. Oh, hi. It's down below. Oh no. Um Cheer Cliff? No, no, no. I think we're good. Perfect. <laughs> oh no, an abductor. At least we know what to do about him now. Don't know what to do about that. Car just took some massive damage there, though. Great, you're all short circuiting and. Ugh, oh, you're gonna be fine. Don't worry about it. You have any uh, solution here? Fix, none. <laughs> Full of juice. A recent arc. Uh, discharge or a blast of electricity has filled this with a hair bristling amount of energy. It'll discharge itself in time, but until then, it's probably not a good idea to get this wet. Oh, or you may see unusual behavior. Uh oh, don't start raining on me. No, this isn't the time to do that. Oh my god, those things are gonna zap me. Oh! Car, where are you going? Oh. <laughs> what a weird, wacky thing this game this game is. <sighs> All right, let's actually move on now. I have a flat tire. I have a flat tire. I can't, I can't, I can't. I can't keep driving on that. I knew I recognized that sound. Uh, while I'm at it. Ton of stuff in there, and you go in there. Uh, I think one of my headlights is in dire need of fix. Oh my god. <laughs> Here we go. You know what? I think it's smooth sailing from here. I can't imagine anything other... Anything else happening to this thing. Unless I run into a tree. There we go. Uh, I gotta, I gotta wonder. How many Let's Plays start singing On the Road again at least once in their playthrough? Because I had an urge just now. I'll stop myself, but... You're struggling to go past 40 miles an hour. Is that because of this charge? 
I know it can go faster than that. <sighs> okay, okay, so you have one there and one there. What? Well, this is where we need to head. But there was, was, was there also one there that I missed? Shit, there might have been a stabilizer somewhere. Nope, never mind. All three are here. A maze. If you get lost, follow the pipes. The limb tech awesome. and those stabilizers ran so damn hot, only more limb tech could contain it from complete meltdown. Sure. Uh, since we're not going back for a minute, I, I, I need to do this. I don't think we'll make it through <laughs> this zone if I don't. It's actually going to take a minute. Hold on. The Tobias and Francis were going on about, but don't worry, I won't be nearly as long-winded. Because there honestly isn't much that we know about it. It happened on the morning of September 14th, 1961. My colleague, Dr. James Kay, was conducting experiments at a highly classified site in the Deep Zone. He was assisted by my husband, Dr. Alan Turner. At 0400, their experiment unleashed a gamma ray surge that instantly killed both of them. The Ooh. surge was an impossible amount of energy, orders of magnitude greater than any mad mage source. It also triggered hallucinations in anyone awake within a 10 mile radius. It was a burst of widespread insanity, but only for a short moment. Oh. Okay, so... So when did you say that was? I suppose we can always look uh, relook at those. It, it'd be transmission, mass hallucination. 1961. So her husband... Unleashed an a gamma ray surge that killed both of them. That's why she's freaking out about the hallucination thing, because that's what killed her husband, and people are talking about how they, well, the other two are talking about how they experienced it for a moment. Interesting. I should probably read these, shouldn't I? Storm activity in this part of the zone is ra remarkably rapid. After it manifests, it'll close in much faster... Close in much faster. Okay. Okay, so the, the, the storm... You gotta get out of there. Uh, this part of the zone is frequently subject to high winds. Increased magnetic interference means that the signatures in this part are indistinct. Oh, they don't move. They don't move. We just... The, the signature moves, but, but they don't. So I could have found them with the radar I had. That was probably accurate. Good, good to know. Um, I do think I need to make one more of these. Why can't I take you out? Oh, down. Oh, we were almost done. I just want to make sure most of it's not that low. That's, that's bad. Okay, so you're good, you're good. Headlights good, bumper. You... I, I haven't scanned this. Uh oh. It's fried. Perhaps uh, it was some tremendous surge of energy, a violent discharge, or a sudden volt. Whatever the case, his light has shorted and no, shines no more. I need an electrician's kit to fix it, which means I should probably just make. I don't think I can make one right now. Could technically make one of those can't craft that here. Yeah, I'll make a crude headlight so we have a working one. Um. Shit. And then I guess I'll put you in here. No. No, not in there. In there for now. Uh, can I make room to... Fit the Yeah, yeah I can. 
I'm gonna need more repair putty permanently, so one, two. And we need a cr uh, pr 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 pry bar. <laughs> awesome. Oh. Go down gas. Don't need lights on, because it's officially 9 a.m. Yay. Uh, I think I'm going to go east first. And we're actually kind of running out of uh, rooms, so I'm not going to search every little house. If I see anything unique, definitely, because I do need to... What is that? Need to scan everything. Yeah. But what are you? You're not an anomaly? What are you? Oh, you are. <gasps> Holy shit. <laughs> Uh, telephone scramble. Tobias, this is Francis Cook. Yes, the scientist. I've got a bit of an update for you. I'm afraid it's bad news. Those drums of experimental gravity gel we're sending, we were sending back to you are not going to get there. And neither is the truck, it seems. We uh, had some kind of atmospheric shift, and then more anomalies than I think I've ever seen before. Everything, Everyone's safe, but our driver has broken his leg. And... As for the gel, well, the whole strip of road between our lab site and that old gas station got smeared and scrambled. So now it's more like a giant kind of trampoline? No, I'm not kidding. Anything that touches that road, it just takes off. <laughs> it's starting to spread to some of the forest and swamp nearby. It's not that the gel is just spilled on the ground. It's like a part of the ground now, a part of the earth itself. So I guess you can update your inventory logs on that. Is there some kind of maintenance request that I should file for this? Interesting. <laughs> oh, this is gonna hurt. Whoa! Okay. Glad we got that one. Uh, I do want to break down the truck. Well, I got what I could, but apparently the radiation hot dust just kind of started over here, so nope. I'm out. Whoa. What was that? Oh god, they're everywhere. I don't see a storm nearby, it's just random hot dust. It's fine, the car will hang in here, but I won't. 5k! 5k! Oh, it's blocked. Hot dust is not worth getting out of the car for. Oh my god. This was just back there. <laughs> no, not rain. The streamer friendly uh, radio has been great. I hope it's not too too quiet. You're just listening to me yell while the game is dead silent, but I'm pretty sure that's how the first episode was. Because I was... I was not checking the volume nearly as uh, well as I could. It shouldn't take long, right? Okay, that's the way in. Oh. Oh, electrician kit. <laughs> 
This will help with the reduction. Yeah, but but I think I can't use it on the headlight itself. I have to bring it back to fix it. Maybe. You got nothing on this building? I can't seem to like scan it, but it, like right here it says I haven't logged it. There we go. It is reassuring to know that I know we at least have some ability to temper this particularly demented flavor of meteorology that blights our atmosphere. The energy demands are truly monstrous, and the infrastructure we have had to construct and reconstruct is an engineering achievement in itself. But we've been successful. We have all but perfected the zone stabilizer. Perhaps now we will no longer be quite so subject to the and to its whims. I believe that correctly activating the stabilizers will now create gateways, though it will also pre press a precipitate dramatically dangerous zone storms. It is important that nobody uses or modifies these devices without explicit authorization. Modified. You know, 30 seconds of hallucinations. Sure didn't feel short when I was free falling through outer space. Heck of a ride though. Did you know the rings of satin sing? I saw disembodied arms. Tons of them. They were grasping and crawling. And, uh, what about you, Oppie? What did you see? I saw nothing. How is that possible? Everybody else saw something. Must have passed me by. I don't know what to tell you. But weren't you working in your lab that night? And weren't you supposed to be doing your research rather than keeping track of my whereabouts? <laughs> okay. Wow. Touchy. Bam. So who are these people? Oh, that, that is a little loud. So who are these people in the grand scheme of things? Uh, they sound so much younger than her. And they treat her like some kind of legend that's been here for a long time. Uh... Well, that's active now. I guess I'll just stay on this road and go over to the other one. There is one house to grab on the way. Oh, now we're getting some speed. Damn. Wow, sorry about the camera there. What? Now that we know the is that we're connected to the mass hallucination, maybe we can figure out what caused it. Okay, okay, there, pause. Spike puddle? Captain Neil Douglas filing. Uh, today, when engaged in <laughs> pursuit of a pair of zone trespassers, the three vehicles from B Company were damaged and put out of action by what may have been traps deliberately laid. The trespassers who crossed from Canada via the Salish Sea and may be fugitives are believed to have landed somewhere near Joyce after traveling via bo small boat. After multiple sightings and extensive tracking, we encountered the trespassers at approximately 1100 hours and began a vehicular pursuit down several fire roads. Uh, driving a stolen uh, government car, the trespassers evaded capture for some time and were able to prevent further pursuit by leading our team across some patches of some kind of semi-organic oil-like spills. All three cars used in the pursuit suffered destroyed tires and damaged wheels. It is unclear at this time whether these patches have been somehow laid in response to the pursuit or had existed sometime beforehand. The patches are extremely dangerous and utterly unlike anything we've seen before. Uh, recommend requisitioning tracked vehicles for Fort from Fort Lewis for further oh, invest boy, oh exploration. Boy, do I have <laughs> Don't start. Okay. Dr. K and Alan clearly uncovered some new way of using limb to motivate that gamma ray burst. Oh, oh shit, yes, wait. precisely. And where do gamma rays come from? But outer space. Feedback on planet Earth, kid. There are plenty of terrestrial sources of gamma rays. Thunderstorms, for example. No, 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 you said it yourself. 
the energy levels from that night are much greater than anything we've seen on All Earth. Right. Sure, but going straight to aliens when there's countless perfectly scientific possibilities. Perhaps Dr. K and Alan developed a limb-assisted mass particle collision. Oops. Oh, heck, tapped into some sort of gamma ray reservoir. Hmm. A reservoir? Or a portal? A portal? <laughs> to where exactly? <laughs> to Atlantis! Of uh. course! Now why didn't I think of that? That's absolutely it! Uh, I'm supposed to break out a mechanics kit here, and I can't. So I guess we're gonna replace you for now? Or just permanently, I think that'd be fine. Um... Oh, shit! There we go. So, it seems like I could have used a mechanics kit. If... If I brought one with me, only if it says it's broken, use a mechanics kit. Oh, I need to go over here. Wait, 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 you're new. Oh, shit. I may regret this. Ah, the crawler, crackling crawler. Hey, Jill. Uh, so we've been through the latest batch of tests and tests, and you're almost, almost everything is negative. You're right that this thing does respond to ground vibrations and clearly it senses nearby movement. But beyond that, there's no reaction to any other kind of stimulus. No light, no sound, no radiation, uh, not any kind of changes in atmosphere, humidity, nothing. The best I can suggest right now is that its behavior is kind of territorial. Often attacking anything it senses is close. Uh-oh. Wait, wait, not that I'm saying this thing is displaying intelligence, it's just some kind of chemical reaction. We're still saying that they aren't intelligent, right? And, uh, anyone even beginning to begin to figure out what these things are made of yet? Good question. Okay, so... It attacks when it's close. Don't, don't let it get near you. I guess. S stay away from it. Speaking of that, I need to eat. That was it. That was all that's in here. Huh. Okay. You know. If they added a food a, a food gauge into this, I wouldn't mind. Just make it a little more survivally. No, we don't need you on. This trip is certainly the longest we've had, that's for sure. Oh no. I don't want to go right or not. It seems like I could just stay over here and walk there. Yeah, I think I'll be safe. It's not like there's cars. <laughs> in the ground up there. Okay, so we're looking for you. Oh, you were a little farther than I thought. I just wanted to stay on the same road as the third tower so we could just get it and go, but... Yeah, I wasn't expecting the game to be this expansive, considering, like, I know there's not too much to the loop itself, like, it's gathered learn more and go back uh, and discover anomalies and stuff. 
Oh, oh, okay. Okay, I see. I gotta be quick here. Oh, there's a guy there. Flip the switch. Hey, Oppie. You've never cared about any of the zone stories and superstitions. It got rid of them. So, why now? What's in this for you? What I do is not and has never been any of your business. You're asking us to trust you. So, yes. It's our business now. How about this? You two sign off and count orbs or whatever it is you like to do. And I'll get the driver to the mass hallucination source myself. Excuse me? No, 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 no. Tobias found this remnant. This is his discovery. Sure. Um. And I'll send you a nice gift basket to mark the occasion. I found it. I won't it. let anyone interfere with this. The hell know. with that? We either throw everything we can at this thing, or we lose this chance, and the answers to the mass hallucination are gone forever. This isn't like one of your little Sasquatch hunts. I'm not letting you get your tinfoil pseudoscience anywhere near this. This is too damn important to me. It sure didn't seem too important earlier, when you messed up and nearly killed the driver. You want to play that game? You really want to talk about our track records? Screw you, Oppie. I'd rather run this remnant into the ground than work with either of you. Oh, forget it. We're wasting our breath with this old man. There's got to be another way. She's out of her mind. I can't do this. I... Look, Ooh. if you want to waste your precious time picking apart bird droppings and squinting at constellations, by all means, follow their lead. I were better off without them. Trust me. I'll get you through no matter what. Uh, this really is my last chance. I, I believe her. I mean, I, I believe I, I, I believe both of them, but I believe following her is is the is the right thing. She seems much more knowledgeable about all this. What the? Oh, it's another one. Hell yeah, free gear. Bam. So are they just gonna hate each other now? Or, well, I mean, it sounds like she's always hated them. They, maybe they're older than I thought. Maybe they all go back. Oh, no. No getting around this. All right. Don't flip the car. Woo! <laughs> I was a little worried it was going to turn me sideways or something. God damn it, another spike puddle? I feel like I'm not turning it. The volume doesn't seem to change that quickly. It like takes a minute to switch. Yeah, there seems to be... Um, we're gonna have to back away from this place to activate the gateway, damn. Maybe, maybe she'll just get us out after we do this third one. What is that sound? Was that my radio? Yes, it was. Bam! Stabilizers are coming online, and the way looks clear, but I'm also getting spikes. The stability in your region is tanking. Get out of there. Ah, oh, shit. Did it activate on its own? Oh, boy. It did.
Wait. Oh, oh, no, no, never mind. Go, go. Well, good thing I accidentally pinned something. Well, we know where to go. I Normally, I have to select gateway myself, but... It's fine. Oh, we're actually not fine. Oh, God. Uh oh. Oh, no. Stay away from that. All right, taking a left. Oh, God. This is a terrible spot. Oh, that thing attacks you if you're too close. It hit me. God, those sounds. Oh! Woo! Complete a run with it. With twice the anchor charge necessary to escape? Oh! You got a lot of anchor charge in? Nice work out there. The sector stabilizers are fully operational. You've got a straight shot toward the expansion wall. One more thing. You may want to consider armoring up a bit. Once you cross that wall, the mid zone is another beast altogether. I unlocked the mid zone? Just like that? Uh oh. Well, it sounds like I gotta, I gotta get through the expansion wall before I can unlock it. Hold on, I wanna, I wanna test this right away. Uh, just mechanics kits, and no, 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 no. Was it this one? Electrician's kit. Did I put the headlight away or did I throw it? It's right here. All right, so if I place you on the ground and then... Yeah, no, you, you can't, you can't fix it this way. <sighs> Which means... I think this is for more than just quirks. I think I could literally just say the headlights stays off uh no 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 that's not it how do you use the mechanics kit on this then i'm really curious about that or electrician's kit not mechanics kit oh i equipped the wrong one maybe i can do it and i'm, I'm just wrong here Okay, okay. So I do want to bring those with me, if anything, then. And same with mechanics kit, if I if I want to do it that way. It seems like it has to have the symbol that says that. Okay. Um. Oh, right. Take you off. Put you back on. Bam. Holy shit. Uh, I do want to go unlock stuff before that, so I'm going to put stuff away. Hold on. This will be a minute. I just saw thought of something, because this respawns every time, right? I think I just have to break it down and hit the button. This is a bunch of free stuff. Wait, am I not? I have to look down more.
And... Anything in here I also have to grab. And then you... You... And instead of wasting my time picking all that up... Yep. Oh, oh, that's amazing. Okay. I'm doing that every time, every run. Uh, and then transfer materials and canned food. And you I'm going to toss, actually. Uh, no, no, I can just do that. I got nothing for it. Can I put anything else away? Bam. Um, oh, I, gu I guess... I need to move you over to my own inventory. We'll put you down for a minute. I got some... That works. I got some stuff to do. Uh, oh, right, right. Oh, I, I have them on me. I... I have to hit open inventory, and then... No, the paint goes elsewhere. You go here, though. I do want to apply that one. <laughs> oh my god. Be beautiful. <laughs> I can't- I can't examine it, though. See, so I can put these on here, but I can't, like, wait, equip? Oh! Oh! Oh, damn. Wait, what, what about this, this door? Why is it... Uh, you can't paint the wood. Here's the wrong color. Oh, damn. This is more in-depth than I thought it was going to be. I'm probably going to be upgrading anyways, so this is uh, wasted, but... Do I have, like, a meter? Yeah, I still have plenty of black paint. Does look like it's like chipped though. I, I that's the only thing I really wanted to get uh, rid of. Okay, so I can just I can just put paint here to put on later myself, which means I can equip you too. Wait, did that put it on the whole car? No. Can I not put it? Oh no, I can. Ooh. Oh. I tried to put it on the gas cap. <laughs> there it goes. I'm doing this. Can I put something on the hood? Oh, hell yeah. Roof. And I, I guess back here, too. Uh, I don't... Yeah, you can't put it on the bumper. Oh my god, that's... I like that. Okay, so... Do you ever run out? You do. Shit. Well... What can you do? I gotta fill up. I didn't even use any extra gas there. I don't feel like gas is really an issue in this game, apparently. Oh, you are giving me stuff. Charge? No quirks. Okay, and then...
Enjoy softer and safer landings. Fall resistance. Um, I'm currently wearing nothing, so... Uh, yeah. How do I equip it, though? Is it permanently... that This is the craft recipe. Round sweater? Wearing. Impact resistance or ele I want electric resistance. Grounded sweater. It's not like we can see it anyways, so it doesn't really matter too much, but... Blocks electrical shocks? Ooh. Okay, I'm guessing we go back here to equip. We just have to... We just have to have more than one of each type. Okay. It may be scratchy and have copper trim, but it literally... That literally grounds you. But it could make all the difference. <laughs> Would it be crazy to harness the remarkable properties of plasma to enhance standard pair of boots? Or would it perhaps make your falls and landing much safer? According to the thing it does. Um, okay, hold on. I gotta put more stuff away. Okay, everything is sorted out. Now to look at the upgrades and then we'll take off. Uh, I did already hit you. You're still giving out stuff. Okay. Oh. Only we had a circuit board. Oh, I have to research it. Yeah. Oh. What do you require, though? Half blank circuit board used for prototyping new layouts. Sometimes known as a breadboard. It should not be confused with or used alongside any culinary equipment. Oh, just go from the top. Okay, that's not bad at all. Yeah, let's do it. Curious. This frequency analyzer and X tracker machine shouldn't be receiving anything. Is it even hooked up to the phone lines? Oh. I've been turned into pure data. I've been turned into pure data. I've been turned into... Okay. Do not delete any files on this computer. What the... Hold on. Yeah, these all go in there. Uh, I can take you back, though. Finally. Finally, I have somewhere to store these. <laughs> Or that makes sense to store them. Okay, um, there's probably nothing else to do here as far as that. It's just another storage, but I needed to get out of the way. We still have plenty of stable energy. Um, now that we've made that, what is it? Athletic simulation? Stimulation. It's such a generously sized target. How difficult could be to score a few points? What? Ooh, a deco vent, which means we could probably get random stuff. Yeah, in exchange for energy. Um, I will wait on that, though. Allow this antenna to be activated multiple times before overheating. Have we even used the antenna yet? I don't know. I do want to look at everything else, though. I need this. I need this right now. I need to make sure we always have a hand vac without having to just get lucky. <sighs> that used quite a bit of energy to make, though. Plasma scrapper. Ooh. 860, 23 piercing. 1638 piercing? You are way better, but I need unstable energy for that. Light replacement kit and electrician kit? Oh, yeah, we do need to actually make those. Yeah.
Um, blocks? Electric? Ooh. Physical resistance. Bio headlights. Side floodlights. I feel like these would be good, but it might use more energy or more battery. I need a side rack for it anyway, though, so I don't know. Oh, so the one with the dotted line we can actually make. Um, insulated panels? Insulated bumpers? Insulated doors block electric charge. That, I think I might make these. Are they better than steel? 40 and 5. I lose impact resistance by doing this, but... On my doors? There we go. Oh, no, no, I gotta look at it. Consumer feedback has consistently shown that humans respond poorly to electric <laughs> electrocution. Based on their sentiments and or the smell of charred flesh, this door has been developed to minimize their discomfort. Good. That's good. Uh, other than that, I may hold off on making the rest that I'm able to. Uh, no, I actually don't have that much energy left. I could, I could do that, but I need another side rack before I can even bother. Oof. Looks like we're, we're going to have to wait on the rest. Yeah, because the things we can make right now... An electrician's kit? Side floodlights, yeah, no, let's, let's make this. Awesome. Now, to see if I can craft these things, and then we will get going. All right. Uh, everything's at 100, there are no quirks. We are going to where? Way over here. You trying to figure out how to pay me a visit? Don't bother. By regular standards, I'm about 10 miles west of you. In zone terms, consider me on another planet. There's a valley of perpetual instability in closing my corner of the zone, and yes, I chose to live here for that exact reason. <sighs> Leave an old woman in peace. What? Uh, I'm guessing we have to take this to get up to there. Uh, this is the safe one, so I guess we're going here? Uh, and I'm probably going to take the, the, the safe one so we can grab some energy. Is there even energy? Hold on. Uh, oh, there it is. Low on energy. Low on it. Yeah, we might as well take that one since they're the same. We can get some energy there too, though. Yeah, at some point I may... Oh, that one has a lot of energy. I may just go do random areas on my own to get some energy, since we have a long time between episodes, and you may miss, like, a few lines of dialogue with her about stuff, but uh, I think we're, we're getting the overall main story regardless. Yeah, so everything's packed up there, everything's repaired, we should be fine. The only thing I could do is make... How many can I have on me? Oh, okay, okay. Um, so you can only hold three per stack, so I, I should only have three of everything, really. Yeah, we're all good. Got the new fancy insulated door only on the driver. <laughs> Does it keep changing the station? The stations like the tracks? I think they are. Probably go up before we take off. Hmm. Okay, so we've already been here. 
This is the one that has like nothing. There's no like connecting roads. It's just a big open area with like dead ends, I think. But uh, there is one electric I'm never examined. Same with like an abductor type that I've never examined. I think I was actually abducted by that thing that isn't the abductor before. I remember getting tossed for no reason. Couldn't figure out what it was. It was near the... I don't know what it is. I would like to find them if I can, though. Alright. Oh! Oh, this is a different road. This one's actually connected. Pretty linear, too. Damn, there's four different energy spots? Hold on, this probably has something. Excuse me. Hello and hello. And there's a house. Oh, it's literally right there. God damn it. I moved like 10 feet. That's the problem with only having a map when you're in the car. <laughs> you get back in and realize you probably could have just walked five feet. Uh, mini fridge? Oh, hell yeah. I don't doubt I'll need a ton of healing items. I'm actually going to put that in there, too. Alright, well, we do have to go off to the left at some point. Is that just a house? Just a random house up there? What? Just very rocky looking. you early. <sighs> Keep trying to get this out of my hands as fast as possible. Hi. Oh no. <gasps> Wait, no, you're just a normal abductor. No! Give me my... Oh! You ass. How dare you. Oh, my windshield's cracked. Should've expected that. I wonder if I can just repair putty that. That is a smooth ro Oh, I have two off-road tires. <laughs> it shouldn't be that smooth, then. Oh, no. Don't do it. Oh, no. Hot dust. Give it the boot. Anomalies bothering you? Wait, I can kick anomalies? Have I never tried? I forgot. Square is kick. See? You can totally see my foot right now. <laughs> What's going on with you? Just a random weird rock formation? I'll wait to seal seal it. Um, I should do that. Careful.
You look like you're gonna have good parts on you. One moment. It did, and it can be registered. Arda Investigator. I think the reality of so much work, even the work that is about our dreams and our ambitions, and the kind of work that we put so much more of our time and energy into, is compromise. My hope was that we would create practical, reliable, mobile laboratories that allow us to better do our jobs. With the zone increasingly unstable, increasingly changing, I thought it was a novel solution. We could analyze many of our findings on site. We could respond to changing conditions in a timely manner, relocating ourselves to new, uh, study new weather behavior or anomalies the moment we heard about them. We could work in a safe, secure environment. On the road? Uh, but now we have this. Slow, clumsy trucks that perform poorly off-road, that lack a dedicated laboratory space, that aren't even her hermetically sealed. The lead shielding built into them is too thin. The equipment we mounted is too old. Budget constraints and compromise I mean we've created nothing more than a portable chemistry set. What's more, Arda have named it the Investigator, like they chose the driest name they could think of. <laughs> and all this will have to do. It was a pretty basic name. Is something happening? God, I always hear like shaking and shifting. Oh my god, get away. Get away. Take it. <laughs> oh. Oh, that one just ran for the flare. Jesus. That actually kind of scared me a little. <laughs> Get out of here before they drag me into another windshield accident. Another tower. I do need plasma. Or I can't make scrappers. Down. Uh, w wait, wasn't there a second one? That's oh, right there. Uh, I think I'm good. I missed. go. And now... No anomalies chased me? No. Oh. That's surprising. Oh no, we've already done that. Okay, now we can actually head back and take the other route, which is very linear. Oh shit. Never mind. I gotta go through there. Although I've never been here before. I wanna know what that symbol is. That's a charging station. Right. We have been there. Never mind. Okay, I'm gonna off-road this all the way over there, I think. At least it's pretty open. I like this. Uh-oh. Careful. Shit. It's gonna come right at the car in a second, too. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. <sighs> you okay? I I think it's okay. 
There's a storm right over our destination. Oh no. It's okay. I'm safe in the car in the storm, and I just need to not be in it for too long, so... Oh no, there's an abductor. I'm gonna regret this. I knew it. I knew it was gonna spawn right on top of it. Oh god, we're heading right into this too. I have to, I have no choice. Okay, you're you're fine. You're looking a little beat up now though. Uh-oh. Uh we have a holy, that's our energy? Damn. That's a lot of energy. It should be right in front of me, but the storm is also here, so... Don't you dare explode under my car! Okay. Okay, okay, we're in the clear. Um... You, you, and I guess this tire too. Alright, um, where's the start? Holy shit, it just... It just left me? Oh! <laughs> we dodged it. Oh, thank god. <sighs> what is that? I have to check. God damn it. We're, we're... Welcome back to Paradise of the Zone. For those of you who are just joining us, we're here with... Wait, what? What was that? Alright, well, I, ha I had to grab that. What? What's up with... Oh, no, just... You're too kind, we'll make a boiled egg, you gotta get the pot. pot uh... You do the opposite. You put the egg inside the pot, and then you put it on the stove. Oh! Well, I mean, Uh, yeah, yeah, you're supposed to put the water in there. Uh, sorry, forgot that part. Well, what part of the steps is, does the water go? What part of the steps does the water go? Uh, in the beginning. You should put it in in the beginning, yeah. Definitely the beginning. Oh! Well, for how long are you supposed to cook it in the water? Mmm, I would say until it's done. Yeah, let's go with that. Let's, uh, until it's done. Oh, okay. Well, this is our first cook season. Thank you for tuning in to KRB Zone. Until next time. I... I'm guessing that was only creepy because it was like an actual broadcast between two people in the zone? 
I thought I thought my car just got hijacked for some reason. Okay, now we can get to the We're not even at the store yet. <laughs> this may be a longer episode. Well, this one did have a different icon, so what did it mean? Anomalous clouds, unpredictable weather patterns in this part of the zone mean more cloud related hazards. What? Cl cloud related hazards will manifest at ground level? C cloud related, that th that means there there's going to be ground th thunderstorms, lightning strikes at ground level? I is that what you're telling me? Oh boy. Well, that's not good. I actually have to get out of here too, so I'm going to grab one energy, and then we're just going to get out so that we can mark the place and go get to the next one. I actually might not even have time to do this. Ah, shit. Ceiling kit, ceiling kit. Bam. That was bugging me. Oh god. This is some heavy rain and wind. I can't express how much I love this atmosphere. I I know a lot of people probably wouldn't because like yeah, there a lot of bad stuff can happen in this weather, but I love being in like this kind of weather. I, I don't know why. Oh, you might have a... You might have a decor station. Jesus. Woo, it's heavy. Uh, you do not have one of those. Okay. You have this. What's with the red lights just randomly all of a sudden? Actually, not much, much here at all. How do I have full battery? What? Hmm. Those are getting pretty close. We are near a telephone pole, so that makes sense. Oh, please don't be actually up top. Oh good, it's on the ground. This could be bad. I have very low health. Why do I have such low health? Uh oh. No, used. We good? No! At two? What is that? What is that for? I'm so curious. Oh nope. Br wrong button. I'll check after. Okay. Now I'll check.
Uh... Oh, damn it. Oh. <laughs> Get hit hard by your car. <laughs> Is that what happened? I, I took 5% damage. Okay. Uh, we are going... Yeah. Oh boy. Should I? I'm scared to cross through the middle because I don't know if it's going to be a cliff or not. Kind of looks like it's a cliff. Oh, right over the spikes. Oh god, there's more spikes. Oh. Holy shit, it's closing in fast. What? Oh no. Oh no! I think we're good. Man, that closed in way faster than normal. Jesus. All right. Is everything still working right? No, interesting thing about those anchor plugs. They use limb technology to stake down pockets of stability in an area. Basically, they delay how quickly you're turned into Swiss cheese out there. They do? They seem like they, they, they hurt me more than they help. Oh, man. Well, uh, we have plenty of energy. We've unlocked the area. I'm actually going to check that first. <laughs> We've locked a another area. Okay, that one's going to lead to it. Uh, which we can take this directly to it. because oh, Okay, so these symbols mean highway, just like this one. Highway, now that we've unlocked a straight highway to it. And we don't need to take back roads to get to it. Alright, so we, we do have to go back in there. And there is a storm unfortunately but we're gonna go there and head into here i guess uh i'll try try to avoid uh angry abductors eerie not recognize not recognize eerie darkness oh yeah yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna head straight here on my own. I'll probably go through it on my own, and then we'll head into this and then this as fast as we can. I probably I think I'll have to do it twice though. I'll have to go here to unlock this, and to, which will make this available, and then I'd have to go again, go through here, straight to that maybe. I don't know. It's it's gonna be rough, but I I want to see the mid zone before we end. So, uh, let me get set up. I'm gonna head back through there. All right. I think that's as good as I can set up. Unfortunately, I can't get repair buddies, so we still have some uh, some parts that are a little weak. Uh, I, well, I can't do anything though. It's fine. Also, you're ringing. What's that? Clap! It's 7 a.m. and time to find out if these anomalies like rock and roll. What? How is there your shortcut across the zone, allowing you to bypass junctions and arrive at your destination much, much faster? Expect these them to be a smoother, easier ride. Okay, so randomly that was blinking because I'm getting some sort of interference from something? Uh-oh. Uh Ooh, that's expensive, but how much better? 500 health. Lower miles per gallon, but way faster. Doing it. Okay. 
It was very expensive. Um, we have very little <laughs> stuff left. Why aren't they in that? They're in that, like, shape. Like, you can add stuff to the engine or something. Weird. Uh, hold on. Oh, thermosap crystals. Well, I can't make those. Steel sheets I could make, but... Two, three, four. Yeah, there's nothing I could do about the thermosap, though. Oh, that's gonna suck. Uh, I could probably put you in here. Yep. Damn. Well, we'll be able to get them eventually. Um... And with that, relatable flare is the only other thing I could make. Yes. Oh, or the athletic stimulation. The, that can wait. I don't even know what it is yet, but... Oh, wait. Still nothing new there. Okay. Let's... Go. It's gonna be a little, uh, I have a feeling it's gonna be a little tedious having to go through the highway and then go to the next area, unlock it, and then go through the highway again, and uh, it's fine now. Oh, that was weird. Hold on. It stopped me halfway on the highway. Well, I was on the map. Do I have to actually travel the highway myself? Oh, it is a straight road, but... Oh. Huh. It seems like we get some free stuff on the way, though. Uh, there are still anomalies, though. I was kind of hoping when they said safer, they meant no anomalies, but... That's fine. Uh, I will, I'm not going to, like, tear apart all these cars at the moment, but I'm going to check your trunk. Uh, I, I, I could just do this. There we go. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do it like that. I absolutely need chemicals so badly, so... <laughs> I don't, I don't really have a choice here. It's gonna be dark as hell. Light it! There we go. No, not, no, no chemicals there. Pressure, no, no chemicals there. Damn. Trash can, you're, you're my last hope. Give me, give me some chemicals. Nope. They are yellow. Nope. Aw, oh, nothing in here had it. Fine. There's one more house on the other end of the highway, though, so... Guess we'll check there. Oh, a tunnel. Oh, I, I guess it's on the map. Don't... Is there anomalies in the tunnel? Like, tunnel anomaly specific? Ooh. Wait, there's a door there, too. What? You can't open that. Oh no. There are gonna be cars all throughout this. <sighs> Excuse me. Well, I got a lot of free scrap out of it, so that's good. 
I'm actually just going to turn that off. Um, there is one house, and then we are on the other side. This is way better than the other method. We, we actually can't form a gateway here either, so no matter what, you still have to go through another area. But I kind of like the way they've done that. Uh, there's there's going to be a lot of backtracking, I can tell that, but personally I don't mind. It gives me some extra time to cool off <laughs> and, and pause the recording, so. Ooh, teal paint. What do you got to say? Bring with you the color of the calm ocean or of a thousand suburban bathroom walls. Let the color that is also known as Alyssa Blue inspire you to drive with a new sense of serenity. Drive in peace. I can't get out of the menu. There we go. That's what I was expecting more out of blue. The other blue made it sound like it was very moody, but... No. Oh, that's a pneumatic tube spot. Uh, they usually have those lit up for that. Okay, bunch of free stuff. Better remember to keep an eye out for them, now that I know the lights are directly pointed at them. Plus, we found some memos in those boxes before, so we still get some uh, lore from on occasion. I wonder if you can scan those. Oh man, well, it's too late. The funny thing is, we're not even at the destination that would lead me to the... Well, actually, maybe. Maybe it'll let me go straight to the new one. Because it takes me back to the map. Or does it skip that? Traveling. You did. You went right, to, yeah, right to the stabilizer zone. Oh, but, oof. Right, I forgot there's extreme conditions here. We need to get here. I think I'll just grab that along the way. Oof. Um, and I also did say I was going to skip most of it, so let's skip a little bit. Oh my god, this is a nightmare. I'm trapped. Oh, you're kidding me. Oh, what is that? Okay. Oh my god. This is truly a disaster. No, I, I, I got, I hit the left right thing. Oh, and I'm taking damage out here. That's not good either. Uh, ceiling. That's all I can do right now. Seal. It's not you. It's you. I hit the left right thing and it led me right into a hidden spike puddle nonsense. Which also led me into some electrical dudes. Oh, and him. I can't forget about him. What do I do? There's a, there's a thing right here. It's off to the right. I don't know if it's worth it, but... No, it's not. Not right now. My car is getting beat to hell. Even, oof. Um. No, 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 no. Um. Try to go around him. I 
I didn't think it was going to be this bad. This is insane. Just ran into him again. I'm, I'm, I'm. A Did I just ride him? My lights are broken. Both lights are broken. I think he's right behind me. Oh my god, my car. I have no chemicals. I can't fix you. I think. Jet. Jet. Okay, okay, okay. Um, I gotta be able to do something. Is there anything broken, broken? Steel panel, completely ruined. You, uh... Oh, I have to log it. Smashed? Oh, no. Yeah, light replacement kit will help for that. Breaking is before that. Okay, so I could repair putty, but since I'm too late, I need a light replacement, which is... <laughs> okay. Are both of them like that? No. I'm in danger right now, by the way. Okay, well, I have one light. One working light. The other one is... Electrician kit. you back. Wait, no. Did I put both back? Where's my electrician kit? Did I drop it? What the? I did not hit square. That was weird. Oh, God. Okay. Headlights are working at the very least. Everything else is, uh... Kind of screwed. Yeah, the hood, the, the, the back door, the trunk, everything's screwed. Okay, let me open this. Grab you. Do that. Whew. Alright, you need to... Oh no, I just... Oh no. And that. Storm warning? I need to get over there fast. Left, right, what are you doing here? Get out of here. Heal. Oh, oh no, oh no. Don't let there be another putty up ahead. No, 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 no. Uh, don't. Oh. It really just like keeps the gas on you. What the? Oh, oh, that's the speed thing. Yeah, that's fine. I think we've already uh, examined that. Nope. Okay, I'm speeding the hell out of here. Oh! <laughs> Keep your eyes on the road. Th this is what you, g you get for texting and driving. As I continue to look at the map. Alright, I don't think I need to look at the map anymore. We, we know where we're going. Oh my god, even the controller is just like hobbling along now it's it's the adaptive triggers are really letting you know your car is in trouble isn't the next area supposed to be worse oh you see like right i'm not safe in the car anymore it said car protection blah blah something Damn it. Okay, okay. We just gotta loop around and take a ride up here. 
I'm just eating all the canned food. So, basically, when I see that shield with a plus on it, that means the car is no longer protecting me. This little uh, wave thing, I think that is the current radiation? Is that what's going on? It was going wild when I was going through hot dust before. Wait, wipers. Wipers, stop! Uh, I think I have a quirk. I don't know what it is, though. The wipers took forever to turn off there. And I have to go through this with eerie darkness and angry abductors? Vehicle side is bad, yeah. Yeah, it sure is. Can I go back? No. No, there's only way there's only one way to go now. I may not look around at all. I think I think I may just activate the thing and go. Because oof. Midnight forest. Okay. Oh, now you're going to tell me about them. Adductors in this part are particularly aggressive and much more active in their pursuit. Great. Heavy fog? That was in the last area. Never seems to lift. Okay. Violent voltage? Electrical discharge uh, detected in this zone are at much higher voltage? Ah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that explains some things. And this zone has this. It's unusually... Even abnormally dark, darker than normal, like even during the day. Oh yeah, it's 5 a.m. right now. Oh boy. Technically, I could hit this and leave right now and, and link this area. I'm a little far away from it though. I think I want to get to that house and then hit it. My poor car, and I, I, I can't even fix it. The only thing I can do right now is m make more parts. Oh no, oh no. Okay, it's not chasing me. Good. Uh, the only thing I can do is make more parts because I can't repair anything without c chemical stuff. Okay, apparently there is a... Ha uh, it's in the middle of a huge radiated area now. Have I... Are you a normal abductor? I do need to scan them at some point. The, uh, not normal abductors. Okay, I think this might be safe enough for me. I don't have enough energy to create it. Or am I just at the line? I think it's going to use up everything just to do it. Oh. Oh, thank you. Okay. All this just to get out of the area. Okay, we're close. I'm I'm too close. I'm too close. Oh shit. I'm gonna go away until I'm far enough away to just activate it and go. Huh? How far away do you have to be? Still red. I know I'm blocking it with my webcam. There we go. Still, it's still red. How far away do you have to be? You have to be pretty far away. Damn. There it is. Okay. 
Okay. Right, right. We, we still have to go back like this. Oh, I just ran right into that. <laughs> this poor car. Who can make it? Oh my. Look at how fast it's closing in. Ooh. That was fast. It was it was constant pace there. Oh. That was hell. Do I do I even have any energy no, no. though? That thing you saw was not Bigfoot. Never was, never will be. Don't let Tobias and Francis fill your head with that nonsense. They haven't talked to me. No, oh, no, I don't want that on. They haven't talked to me since then because we've been just retracing our steps. Oh, oh yeah, you are in danger. <sighs> Alright, let me fix this, and then we're actually going to head there for, for, for once, because I believe we can officially go there. All I wanted to do, all I wanted, was to see this place, and then we can end. <laughs> so I'm going to mark it. We're going to have to go through G1 and G3 again, Oh, which now has swift storms. Oh boy. Uh oh. Yeah, I have to make sure I'm really prepared, so hold on. Okay. Um everything's set. Everything's set. I think we're good to go. Uh I do have two point six stable energy, and part of me thinks that after going through that ride that hell that I should do something better about this like insulated bumpers might be good although impact is kind of more important for those i don't know i can't i can't really figure it out maybe another side rack uh to get that those side lights would be good i definitely want to do something yeah, let's get another side rack actually and then we'll put the lights uh I don't, wait, no, I have to make the lights, don't I? Can I even make them now, though? Phantom rack. Side fuel tank. Side fuel lights. Alright, are you hard to make? Please don't be hard to make. Also, if you'll notice, my, my battery is going down, but I confirmed that the car is off. There's nothing on in it. So, it's got some sort of quirk, I think. Either that, or it's... I don't, I don't know what would cause that, but... Okay, I can make... Make it. Um... Quip. Alright, so you should just automatically be on when the car is on? Why is my battery... It says there's no quirks. Why is my battery on? Th there is nothing on. Is there something on? My lights were on. What the? Why were my lights on? Wait, they weren't on. I turned them off. Uh, well, t something happened. Either way, we are good to go, and I'm ready to see that. I think... Yeah. Good to go. And this is going to be uh, hell. But at least we'll get to see the next area, because I'm not ending this episode till I get to see that mid-zone. See if it's any different than just forest areas like the first areas here. This is a separate anomaly? Interesting. Journal fragment. You know what? And it's an increasingly bad time in the zone these days. Every day, when I step out my door, I should just get a different job. I should do something else. Uh, it's getting worse. I swear, these things are all but springing out of up out of nowhere, uh, out of thin air. 
And now we have this chain reaction thing. This brutal deadly trap that just outright slaughters people. Whole lines of those dummies. Any one of them capable of setting off all the rest. Seven, seven people have died in three days. You know what it feels like to me? Like the zone is murdering us. Even like it enjoys doing so. It's as if something really, really doesn't want us here. And you know what? That's fine by me. Tomorrow morning, I'm out. Can you... can you get out? Also... No. I thought... I thought maybe. Um... I already went through the highway. We're moving on to this one. This still isn't the right zone. Not, not the dark zone. It's... It's gonna be a while. That's for sure. Well, for me it is. Anyway. Cool. Guitar strumming. Did someone just randomly come in and we heard a random guitar? What? What was that about? Uh, oh shit, I have to go that way. Uh, by the way, this area is, uh... Electric does more damage. So, that's unfortunate. Especially considering where I'm at. And the path that thing could potentially take. I don't like this. But I have one... Oh, you prick. I threw a flare. Go get it. I need that to be distracted because... Uh, oh. Oh. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh my god, that... <laughs> I get chills like every time. They're not even that creepy on their own. Oh no, 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 don't get hit by that. They're not that creepy on their own, but but still, still it gets me. I don't know, skip it, skip it. I, I really need parts that I, I hate passing all these houses because I know I need to get them. It's probably the only safe time to do so. Oh no, that's a big one. Thank God for that. Holy shit. That did hurt the car though. Alright, we're almost there. Almost back to the... the what do you call it? Eternal Dark? Is that, is that what the next zone is? And that's before we get to the mid zone? Alright. <sighs> and it's unstable. Oh, that's bad. Swift storms on top of it. Yep. Yeah. Uh-oh. Okay. Okay. Our only goal is to get here. That's all we care about. There's... Oh, man. There's so much stuff I could get out of this place, though. Kind of sucks. But I... Really need to end the episode, so... We need to make it to this mid-wall. Whatever that's going to be like. I think I've been recording for six hours now on like two episodes. Maybe more. Oh, uh, by the way, the floodlights, I, I had to attach them apparently via ability menu, so. In case you happen to be playing too and you're wondering and you couldn't figure it out, it's right there. You, you can, you can select it from there. Okay, big turn, apparently. Did I? What? Oh man, I got too close. It's fine. I, uh, the car is in very good condition compared to last time. 
As long as I don't run into any more left right, those things are deadly. This isn't so bad. Uh No, no no, don't don't get don't get distracted. We'll be re going through these air Oh, it's a tanker. I thought it was a monster. Hey. Whoa. What was that? What was that? Uh oh, this is bad. Well, I, gu I guess this might be part of the lore, the fact that sometimes we get interference from outside of the zone. So maybe just random hay and, and like that, those, the guitar strumming, that, that's just people, maybe it means I'm getting closer to getting out, the closer we are. That could be it. It's a shopping cart. I don't know, I'm very interested in this game. I. I don't really know how. I mean, I would. It'll probably end us, with us leaving. T to be honest, I, I feel like this game is going to be more about the journey than the ending. Because I, I could care less about getting this car out of here. I'm just wanting to experience the actual thing, you know. But you have to have that goal in mind. Perpetual stability. Oh, thank God. Wait, is that a bad thing? I think of all the things. Yeah, no, no, the storm will not be chasing you unless summoned. Yeah, that's a good thing. <clears throat> we made it. To whatever this mid-zone is. And there should be unstable energy here. Or whatever they called it. I guess technically we're not in the mid zone yet. Oh. Okay, okay. Probably want to grab that energy while we're here. Uh-oh. Let me out. I might as well check here. Ooh, a workbench. Too bad I haven't looked around up to this point, or I would have materials for, for making some car parts here, but... I mean my major goal here is to look at look at the mid zone. So we're gonna we're gonna get into it, but we might stop like once we're there. We'll see. Ah uh, maybe 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 I should get gas. I don't know how long we're gonna be stuck there. It doesn't reach that far. There we go. Put it back. And we're off. I'm only going for the one up top, though. Doesn't seem like there's any anomalies here in the first place. Are there very few? There's one. It's really not that much, though. I think I could probably walk from here. I'm gonna open this door, though. Ah, oh, there you are.
All right, I'll come back for you. Ooh, okay, that was risky. Isn't there a house nearby too? I think there was. Hi. Oh, that still hit me. <laughs> there it is. Okay. I feel like I'm getting faster at this game at the very least. Uh, just put this outside the door, it's fine. The hell was that? That's got me a little worried. Is my car doing okay? Kind of sounded like a car being dragged. here did we get any chemicals we got one one okay something was clearly being oh it was probably you guys I would assume okay No more distractions. We're going right for the goal this time. Nope. I do kind of wish there were more variety in the songs. I think there's only like three or four. Gotta veer off to the left. Oh, that's a big wall. There's the expansion wall. It separates the outer zone from the mid zone, and more importantly, us from those two idiots. This will get you one step closer to the deep zone. It's far past its prime, so watch your step. Do I got a second auto shop? I would love to have a second auto shop so I don't have to take this trip back every time. Oh, so just go in one. You having some trouble? Why are you changing the radio? That might be a quirk. That might be a quirk, I think. Oh, damn, these are some big tunnels. Hot? Maybe it's not a quirk. It is a quirk. Okay, so when I turn the wheel left right, uh, the car changes the radio station. Ooh. There's a lot of stuff back there that I missed though, isn't there? Oh no, no, no. It's, it's uh, back here. On. Let me just take a look quick. Oh, hello. An empty backpack. 
cooler with one thing in it. Maybe it's up top. Maybe you can get on top of the wall. You guys suck. Oh, I just learned something new. Okay. We're just going straight and taking a left eventually out of the tunnel. Lots, lots of tourists here, yeah. It's like a chain reaction. Oh no, oh no. There's anomalies in here too. Hold on. I have to do it. Alright. Is there something in here? There is. Ooh. Food. I need you. Uh, and in here. Whoa! A little close, buddy. Screw it. You're in my way. Oh, I screwed up. <laughs> An impact hammer? Really? Okay, more stuff. I am in danger in here. Ooh, there we go. Anomaly encounters one. So, I was in the deep zone, taking notes. I screwed up a page and threw it aside. And that was when it first happened. Something I couldn't see, but I swear was there ate the paper I dropped. Later, I would hear it rummaging in the dumpster. It's all the, those old journals we tossed as part of the move. Those drew it out. It would eat cardboard, too. I heard you could get it to follow you by dropping scraps as you walked. You'd never see, the, see a thing, though. It was like a ghost. But you'd sure hear it. Interesting. That That's in the deep zone, though, so... I kind of want to test it. Radio, what, what? What's up? Why? Why are you freaking out? I don't think the radio's working right now. Probably don't get signal out here. Okay, we have to, uh, nope, nope, not yet. Right here we have to take. Oh. Oppy, I'm gonna need some, uh, some guidance here. This map is not normal. Oh, there we go. That would explain everything. Okay. 
where is this going to take us, though? We're not, we're not taking a gateway back. I might have to end as soon as we get here. God, I'm so curious, though, which means no... No prepping between episodes. Ooh, okay. Oh, do I have to activate a stabilizer? To get her to... Probably. There we go. Hello, friend. Welcome to our side of the wall. Oh, what's this? Your connection to Wabi is jammed. Ah, uh, worry not. Our signal is crystal clear. A little bit obvious, don't you think? <laughs> right, ask me if I care. Yeah, the mid zone's been marinating in all this radiation for so long. Things don't work the same as they do in the outer zone. But the good news is, we live here. We can help you, no sweat. <clears throat> first things first, we've got to extend the signal from the garage. Otherwise, Oppie's equipment won't be much help. Hooking you into a mid zone stabilizer should do the trick. Look around. You should be able to see one up a hill somewhere. Okay. So this is a, this is not, this is more open. This is less of a forest and more of a kind of a mountain, wetlands almost. Oh, I can see this one being a little bit creepy. What is that out there? Oh no. I go to the left. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Shit, what, what is that? I have to get out and check it. I have to. Also, can I, I can't, I can't like scan that. I can't scan like trees or anything, but what are you? Shaggy Scrambler. We nearly got him, Sally. We're within an inch of catching that notorious, that Scott guy. We almost did it. I swear it to you. Uh, we're gonna triumph where the regulars just can't. After 11 months hiding in the, out in the zone, stealing cars, breaking into shelters, taking food, you know how we're, we were gonna do it. Anomalies. We used roadblocks to funnel them deeper to where we were, or where we knew those beasties malfunction things were. You know what they did? A whole pack of them descended on his car, right in front of us. His engine dies, his battery burns out, his steering locks. He ends up stuck in the middle of the road, with nothing but his regrets. And then, uh, somehow he still gets away some- somehow. No, twice somehow. Just melting into the darkness. I guess I didn't help that all our cars had started malfunctioning too. But that's not what matters. Mark my words, we'll catch him next time. What does that have to do with the- You're trapped. Aren't you? Oh, you're not. What do you react to? Oh no! Don't 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 toss that. Well, maybe. Huh? Oh shit! You think they reacted to sound or light? And then it just <laughs> drug it. it. It drags itself to your car. Those things are creepy. Oh, God. I thought it was coming from me. Oh! Okay. Whew. Good one. Good one. 
good one. I just want to make it up to the stabilizer before we end. <laughs> you know what? I think I can do it. I got off-road tires. We're good. Keep going. What? Oh, battery. I'm almost out of battery, too. There's apparently something nearby me. Yeah, that's not great. Oh, that's just for slopes. Yeah, it wasn't great either. Whoops. It's so quiet here. Not to mention my car keeps deciding that it doesn't want sound. Um, battery, jumper, um... There it is. Ooh, that was a big ass charge. Okay. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> I'm getting distracted. This place certainly has a different vibe. Unfortunately, it's got nothing in it. This radio. Okay. You gotta have something on the outside then. Oh, there it is. Uh, anything else? No, what? What a tiny random spot. Okay, we're taking a right up ahead. Oh, it's 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 right there. Giant. Okay, now unless you're telling me to stabilize and then take a gateway out of here, I may have to end this after this. Bam. Okay, a stabilizer in section D is online. Coming through loud and clear. Hey Francis, pan the car's broadcast frequency to the stabilizer, would you? Come on, I can't do this without you. Fine. There. Your receiver's hooked in now. And we're patched into all that sweet arc device data. <laughs> nice work. Abby won't be able to block us out anymore. Well, better get going. Here it comes. Oh. Okay, okay, so we do have to escape. Holy shit, we got a ways to go, though. I really hope there doesn't seem there is there is some sort of water over there actually. Maybe I could cross over to the right. Oh, <laughs> this place is definitely more eerie. Oh God, it's it's closing in fast. Oh, shit. Okay, uh, technically I need to... Oh, there's a pneumat pneumatic tube. Technically I should be on the road right now. There it is.
make sure I don't go right into the water, so we take a left. Oh god, there's the red. We're, we're, we're in the clear. God, those sound effects are so good. It's so creepy. Ooh. Complete a run with at least four junctions without breaking or removing any car parts. Wow, well that's almost didn't happen. <laughs> wow. Poppy was hiding a magic teleporter? We could have been beaming all over the zone this whole time. Uh, don't worry, I'll restore her connection once you do us a little favor. Oh we my Dobby's God! We a copy of Otis' database in that auto shop of hers. Find it, and we can get back to this remnant business. So I need to get the password. I'm assuming to get in here. Recover Arda data. Oh wait, what is this? All right, I've I've identified the electrical circuit for the garage's security system. And there's an Arda security lock in that circuit. So once I do this, yeah, bingo! That security lock's powered on now. We try that overload code from the observation towers. Oh. 0735. Result of ongoing forest fires raging through the air quality suffers. Despite growing concern from state officials, Arda have refused to grant firefighters access to the to the to the to the. Unlock the. This is the bathroom. Driver, something you should know about that database. When Arda's funding began to dry up, they handed us our final paycheck with one hand and the same day evacuation orders with the other. Poppy was a higher up, though more entitled than an actual power by that time. She would have known about Arda's plan to close up shop and had enough time to download all the research data before losing access. That data could contain what we need to help you. I don't know if you're trying to help me or the car. I don't trust these guys. Find her hideaway. Why can I do this? But why is there? Oh. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Arc dog. Oh damn. Okay. Um. Oh, I can only take one at a time. Database with gears of limb research stolen from Arda by Oppie herself. All right, I'll come back for you in a sec. Boy, oh boy, look at all these gizmos uh, again. Oppie wasn't operating no normal auto shop. Fabrication state. Oh, you did it. Hey, you actually did it. Oh, boy, Audi, I cannot wait to dig through all this data. I feel dirty. Why did I do that for you? I'll fix Oppie's connection. Do you read me? Come in. Do you read me? Loud and clear, you old bat. I see. The comms clear up suddenly, and I find you two patched to the garage frequency. It all makes sense now. No idea what you're talking about. So, Oppie, what's the, uh, what's the plan? You must have some grand scheme, don't you? Let me get this oh. straight. You hijacked my my frequency and now you want to be all buddy buddy not on your life Ooh. you think you're hot stuff why don't you take the lead then get the driver through all by your damn selves no did she just hang up on us well guess it's our time to shine <laughs> so uh francis you got any ideas oh great we know the driver needs to get to the deep zone but it's too dangerous to head there directly we have to zero in on exactly where to go the signal amplification trick won't work here. The ambient instability is too strong in the mid zone. Huh, how indeed. Um, 
there was one other time where the mass hallucination and the remnants intersected. Drive, I've tagged a route for you. Whenever you're ready, give it a spin. Hmm, okay. The visions. Damn, we just got a lot of stuff from that. Oh, and a repair buddy? Oh, thank you. Uh, I have some stuff to put away on. I wish I could close this garage door somehow. It's so loud. Uh, definitely interested in seeing how where we're going from here. And now that I wasn't really expecting them to have much of a story, but it seems like our we've switched to Oppie not being the helpful one, and now we're doing. Those two, <laughs> which should be interesting. Okay, so we have the whole dark zone here. We can also get a highway. Oh my god, I have to go through this, 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 and then that to unlock a highway straight there. Are you kidding me? That's a lot of backtracking. I mean, it's fine, it's fine. I'm totally fine with it, but uh, that's gonna take a minute. I also really want to search the stuff up here. Uh, I may do like like this one and this one on my own, even though it does seem to link to a lot of stuff. Uh, do do like the little side ones on my own, at least some of them. I don't know, d just so I can gather some materials and get us ready. I before I end, I want to want to at least expand a little bit. Other way, other way. Yeah, it's moving a lot of materials. Holy shit. Okay, and the, uh, what is this dock for? Nope. Enhanced version of the ARC device able to administer rudimentary pain relief and first aid to the occupant. However, this energy will require a substantial drain. You still remain unsure if this device is a work of... Oh. So, like, if I'm dying in the car, maybe it'll heal me? Is that what I'm hearing? Something like that. Interesting. I don't know if that's exactly what it said, but... Oh, we have 5.1. <sighs> um... I'm gonna have to get an expanded locker here soon. Um, we need... Repair station? Oh, man. Oh, it's uh, unstable energy. It's going to be a while. We'll probably need the deep area. Deep zone for that. Uh, let's just look at tools quick. I need... I want to be able to make this. But I need unstable energy for that. Thermal vacuum. Unstable energy. Unstable energy. You know what? What can we make? Liberator. Relatable flare. Insulated panel. I think a seat rack would be good. Yeah. Back seats are going to waste, so. Uh, definitely this side first. So, what can we put in the seat? Obviously not the side fuel tank, but maybe maybe I could actually take uh Can I take you and put you in there? No. So something's got to be able to go there, right? I can't just it can't be nothing. Just don't don't see any immediate options. Maybe like a uh, expansion rack car storage uh, I don't that this expands our normal car storage fuel battery utilities I don't I don't know where it'll be but we'll find it eventually um for now I don't think I can make anything uh, that I care to make except for that but we don't have enough side racks yet anyway. 
Lead plated door? Radiation resistance? Ooh. Can't make them yet, but. You know what? Let's get insulated panels. And then maybe insulated or different headlights. Roof headlights? That might be interesting. But. No, we can't do them yet. A relatable flare would be good, though. Just to, instead of carrying around 20, especially if it costs, like, flares to use, then, then we just make them with flares. Yeah. I see no reason not to. Technically, we could make a flare gun now, but I would only make it to make... Ooh, a bio lantern. 22,000 durability. Okay. Let's make the bumper, too. Oh. Oh. I believe that's all we can do right now. Uh, besides this. You know what? Let's, let's see what this is. It made it sound like it's, it's a, a course or something, so I, I have no idea. Oop. Oh, it's a basketball hoop. Yep. Okay. What, is there an achievement for... Oh, I see. I see. It's gonna be a pain. <laughs> oh my god. It just bounces back. Oh god, ha- There's an achievement. There's guaranteed to be an achievement here. I don't- <laughs> I don't think it's happening. Well, we bought it. Now we can make other stuff that it was locked behind getting this. Uh, that. Uh, yeah, that's not happening. You know what, it's fine. It's fine. But getting that unlocked... Deco vend. I need unstable energy, though. Okay, so I'm going to end this here now, finally. Uh, it, sometimes it's really hard to end. You know what, before we end, bam. Blueprints for the Liberator, whatever the hell it is. You can end this here in the next one. Uh, we'll probably have to do a little bit of looking around and retracing before we can move forward, but I'd love to get more... Or some mid-zone exploration in. So, uh, hopefully that'll be on the table. But that's it for this. So thanks for watching. Let me know if you like it. And I will see you in the next one.